Hello, my name is Jess Erb, the founder of Centered Self and a therapist in Toronto. My pronouns are she, her, and this little one is Maggie. <laughs> my name is Ryan Benninger. I manage operations for Centered Self. I work out of Denver, Colorado, and my pronouns are they, them. In this video, I just, we want to give a little message to anyone who's closeted within the LGBTQI population. And I just wanted to ask you, Ryan, what would you say to somebody who is seeing pride, seeing all this celebration and yet feeling like maybe they can't celebrate because they haven't yet come out to themselves? Sure, it can be a really difficult position to be in. Um, sometimes people face a lot of pressure from the LGBTQIA plus community about coming out. Um, and I do actually really want to take a moment to say that if you're not out, that's fine. For some people, they're not ready to come out. It would be a change to their life that they're not wanting or ready to make. Um, and it might be a very real safety issue as well. Yeah. Um, and pride is definitely for you. Um, and anytime, I can only speak for myself, but anytime I'm at pride, you're on my mind. Mm -hmm. um, and so you can come along to the celebration or the protest. Um, and, and be in our hearts in that time. Absolutely. It can feel really scary right now that like everyone else gets to have this party maybe and that you don't, but we're partying for you. We're protesting for you. And if you need to talk to somebody, anyone, we, we can be your first stop. Feel free to give us an email, um, drop by centeredself.ca or even just send us an instant message to this. We're happy to hear from you. Your voice really does matter and you don't have to be alone in this.